Hey guys, what's up, and welcome back to some more <coughs> Max Payne 3. Um, we left off in this beautiful fire. This whole place is coming down. Perfect. If I wasn't immolated, I was gonna get crushed to death. I turn my volume down a little bit. Alright. <coughs> Look at me. I've been contracted to protect two people. One was... You better stop talking, man. That's what's... Oh, what? What am I supposed to do there? Ready try. Alright, that was kind of weird. I didn't really have time to react. I guess don't go by the stairs. I tried going up it and that was a that was a complete fail. I just make sure there's nothing behind me. Perfect. If I wasn't immolated, I was gonna get crushed to death. Yeah, I don't know what you're supposed to do. It's like, Look you can't me. go up the stairs. I've been contracted to protect two people. One was being held in some hole. Oh, you gotta the do other this. Was sitting I at see. his desk with a bullet in his head. <laughs> and the company that had its logo on my paycheck was melting on top of my head. Alright, I see, I see. During the one he was talking, you, you had to walk up. Okay, I didn't know that. I didn't know. I was just, I, was like, I thought it was like a, just a little Shit. cutscene. If I survive this, it'd be a victory for gross incompetence. The kid hadn't made it. Fuck. I had to make this corpse looting coward pay. Getting his gun was more than just expediency. Come on, come on! I was in no state to save his body from the flames. I hadn't saved him from the gunman either. I'm sorry, kid. Very forgives you. I'm gonna go over here real fast. Just make sure there's nothing over here. All right, nothing over here. This is like that would be a, a good place to put a gold weapon. People would walk right past that. Why does everyone just want to get the fuck out of the The building's collapsing. All these Don't people want to do is kill me. Move. I can't move and then the guy's fucking right there I'm about dead. I have no painkillers. Yeah, that was uh that was a close one. I'm still living though. Rodrigo or not, Fabricast Bronco is falling apart quite literally. Despite his manners, I'd done him a favor. No, it's true. You did do him a favor. You should. This didn't look like a room where Rodrigo closed multi-million dollar deals. It looked like a fiery hellhole. I missed a lot of shots there. Should be one more hiding behind that counter. All right, well that will do that. Let's make sure, I'm just gonna take a quick look and make sure there's not a golden piece anywhere. The only way doesn't look like it. That filing cabinet. Look at this, you could probably shoot your way out right here. I guess it's bullet... I, yeah, I guess it's bulletproof uh, glass. That would probably be the most ideal way to get out of the building though, right through there. If, that, if that's what we're doing, that's what I just assumed, that we're trying to get out of the building, but... Who knows if that's what we're actually trying to do. Probably well, we may be looking for something. I just assume we're trying to get out. This is very bad. So There's much no way we're gonna be able to walk Sunday afternoon. 
My next trick would be a high wire act with a fiery pit for a safety net. It was nice that no one was shooting at me for a change, but I'd take shot in the head over a slow roast on a spit any day of the goddamn week. I think anyone would do that. <laughs> oh, you're not done yet, buddy. Someone up ahead was hurt pretty bad. If he didn't die before I got to him, I might get some answers. You better fucking hurry, I'm trying to walk. I guess it's just a cutscene, I can't do anything. Hey! Why? Why Rodrigo Bronco? Why? What? Why did you come to kill Rodrigo Bronco? We came to kill you! Because of what you did to us! You killed so many of us! What reason did this poor bastard have to lie? He would be dead from shock or loss of blood in half an hour, even if I didn't leave him there to burn. Where's Fabiana? Fabiana Bronco, where is she? I don't want to I got her. Up the hill. Then it was up the hill for me, I guess, where the gang held sway. I had to try to figure out who was using Jeez, he's gonna drag that guy there. clowns as some kind of front to kill Rodrigo. Just shoot him, man. He did us. He did us a favor. If I have the chance of shooting, I'm gonna do that. I hope I guess not. I was gonna put him out of his misery. I was a mess. Rodrigo Bronco was dead. Fabiana was held hostage. I had no idea who was behind any of this. I felt like a fool. I was a sweaty, gray-haired mess. This place, well, this place was gonna kill me too. I could see that now. I decided that I was going to die sober, not drunk. Ah! At least then I would see who shot me. It was time to take back control from whoever was out to get me. And if I didn't flush them out, at least my midlife crisis would confuse them enough so they did something stupid. It was the only hope I had. I knew I wasn't thinking straight. I'd been drinking and popping painkillers for years. I had a liver like a French goose and skin like red leather. Okay, what the fuck is he doing? Going bald. Well, it wasn't perfect. In fact, it wasn't much good at all, but it was gonna have to do. At least I was facing in the right direction. He looks a lot better without the hair. I don't know if you guys agree, but it looks a lot like he looks a lot more like a badass. Oh, is that a black? No, it's not. I was about to say it looks like a blackberry, but never mind. It didn't. For a second, it did. Hello. Hello, Victor. Max? Max, you're, you're, you're alive? Of course I'm alive. We did not know this. We are lost, Max. Our brother was everything to us. I understand. Listen, I'm, I'm sorry about your loss. Both of you. Rodrigo was a good man. I failed him. I, but I was tricked. What happened, Max? I don't know. Some guys from the crush of Prado came into the building downstairs, so while me and the security guard were dealing with them, an assassin must have come in and executed your brother. I, at least that's how I think it happened. No, you killed him, Boha. You killed my brother. What are you talking about? 